skies all around for the first time since we arrived a week ago. We are heading up into the mountains. We're going to investigate the Gap of Dunlow, which a lot of you have said is a must-do in this area. Well, bearing in mind how beautiful the rest of the place is, I can't wait. I can't wait to see what this one holds. This is our lunch stop at Moles Gap. I just don't have anything else to say about it really. Just arrived at tonight's park up. Just had a word with the farmer. He says, yeah, it's fine. This is fine if you don't get stuck. Because <laughs> uh, just here, as Andy's just about to tell you, we'll get cut off at high tide. It's a little bit sandy, but no problems. But look at this. And the beach is just over that dune there. So we're going to go for a swim. And there we are. Look at that beauty. Excellent. Nice spot, isn't it? Yes. It's well chuffed. Well chuffed. As you've just seen, we have just spent the night by the beach. Uh, we moved from our original position because there was a, we found a, a lovely um, parking area in the dunes, on top of the dune. It's quite soft, a um, little bit skiddy in places, um, but oh, what an amazing view. It was fantastic, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, and we got to see the sunrise as well this morning. Yeah, it was a gorgeous sunrise. <coughs> Excuse me. Went for a walk at sunrise, didn't we? Just after breakfast. Yeah. Now we're all packed up, ready to go, and we are, today's plan is the Dingle Peninsula. Yeah, so parts we'll, of it. As always, see where we get to. Yeah, let's have a good time. We are currently at Dunmore Point, which is overlooking the Blasket Islands, which is where an ancient settlement was. 
Ooh. Until 1953, people lived on those islands. Yeah. Uh, but just behind us there is Slee Head, which is the most westerly point in Europe, yeah. it turns out. And also around here, um, lots of Star Wars. Um, the latest lot of Star Wars, I think, were filmed. Yeah. Please feel free to correct me if I'm <laughs> wrong. <laughs> We have just climbed up to the top of Dunmore Head and I'm going to say it again, wow! That's amazing! Stunner of a view isn't it? Yeah. So here we are at Dunquin Pier, again, maybe pronounced wrong, for which I apologise. I have googled it this time and that's what it claims you pronounce it like. It is beautiful. You're walking down this windy, windy path to the bottom. Yep. Sadly actually it's not as pretty as at the bottom, because it could be, it could do with a bit of a tidy up. But look at the but sea, this. look at the views. It's just breathtaking. It could almost be a Caribbean island, couldn't it? Yeah. It's almost warm enough as well. <laughs> it is actually, one. yeah. It's amazing. Let's go and have a look. Currently in the Museum of the Blasket Islands. Uh, this building is just off the charts, isn't it? Make a nice extension. <laughs> what a fantastic house. If you're in this area, it's most definitely worth a visit. Um, we've just finished in the auditorium. Well, there's a little video of the last descendants of the island. And here's one of the boats that they made on the island, made of canvas and tar, wooden structure, obviously. Behind us is the Blasket Centre, which we've just been in. It was really, really interesting, wasn't it? Fantastic. All yeah. about the life of the people on the Blasket Islands, which are over there. As I mentioned earlier, everybody left in 1953. But we are now going down to the viewing platform, which also looks like a stunner. Mm -hmm. So here we are at the viewing platform. And there, straight in front of us, is Great Blasket Island and the pointy one to its right that you can just see in the distance is um, one of the Skelligs, it might be Great Skellig or Michael Skellig and that's what we could see, was it yesterday or the day before when we were at the chocolate factory? What the chocolate's uh, named after isn't it? Yes.
You can get a ferry over to um, Great Blasket between April and October, weather depending, of course. Which is definitely going to go on our list of places to come back to, isn't it? I think it is, yeah. We are just driving down 